All right, everyone, welcome back, everybody. <laughs> what a day. Uh, have you seen my previous episodes here of, of all the um, all the nice little accessories I had here? Um, as you know, I'm still I'm going to do the seat here, uh, but if you noticed, I had some issues with this particular hole. Um, um, maybe I can just go to the store and just find a stainless steel something that I could put in there. Uh, what's the other one? Um, uh, the other issue I had was the head stripped off of this. Uh, so if you want to see the actual head, and it looks like I had a little, a little bit of room here quite a bit of room to actually keep going a little further but uh, was unable to um, and then now I'm going to I'm going to actually do the seat post here the suspension seat post now so so wish me luck on this here uh, I think this is going to be really quick this should be the quickest out of all of the All of them. Uh, okay. Let me see if I can just. Okay, I need to. I need to. I need to loosen this and then just snap this into place. So let's see if I can do that. How hard or how difficult it is. Hopefully, it's the same size. And no, it's not. It's a little bit larger. All right. So. Okay. Back here, and there we go. Okay, let me see here. Let's loosen this up a little bit, loosen both of them up. There we go. So hopefully it's that easy, but you never know with these things. Okay. Yeah, there we go. It, it kind of kind of is that easy. in here. There we go. Seems like you can do this by hand. Okay, there's one. So let's go in here. Get a better view. There we go. There's two. Seems like the angle that I want it at. Tightening it by hand right now, and uh, well, let's just uh, compare on this one because this is already loose. That's a little high here, so I just have to angle it down a little. I'm just, I like the way the seat is now, so that's why I'm, there we go. That looks just about right. And so uh, looking at this seat, let me see here. There's some measurements. There's some measurements right here of where it is. Uh, so let me put it in the same place here where I would like it. Let's see if that works. I 
Okay, let's see if that works. It's going to be up. Let me see here. It's going to be... It needs to go back a little bit more here. Excuse me, I'm just making a seat for myself right now. Out of my old crate. Okay. So, let's see how this thing... It needs to go back a little bit. I like where the seat position is now, so that's why I'm doing this. Obviously, I'm going to have to be at the front at the max right there. That's probably going to be my new seat position. Maybe, do I have it the wrong way? Maybe it's supposed to be like this. It's supposed to be like this, or is it supposed to be like this? Hmm. Let me look at the directions. Maybe I put it in the wrong way. Um, let's have a look at that direction one more time. Let's see how it's supposed to look. Let me see, there's a picture of it. So... Okay, I got it in backwards. So it looks like it's supposed to be angled the other way. So, okay, I got it in backwards. That could have been, that might have been the problem. Let's see here. Probably the issue that I had. I, I had it on backwards. Okay. So, according to the picture here, according to this picture here, um, it should be like like this. So the rear, the back part of the seat, is supposed to be where this part is right here, on this side. So let's let's do that, shall we? There we go. Alright, so now let's compare it. Now let's compare it. Uh, Alright, so now I got it. Let's loosen it. Let's, let's loosen it now. There we go. Not quite. a little bit is that right sorry for that just trying to match it up here that looks a little bit more forward there we go and where do I want it to be Let me see here. Uh, I think right here towards the rear is where I'm liking it. Right, right about there. There's two lines right here. And there's a max and a minimum. I'm going to put it right next to the minimum. Alright, 
so yeah I think sorry I think this is going to be it right here that looks right so there you go so this is the way it should be is this part right here should be at the at the back towards the back where your butt is and so that's how it's set up here right now let's torque it down that was pretty easy I think okay let's torque this down Okay. Let's torque down. Let's torque this down. Just by hand. I'm having some issues with uh, some of these bolts here today. If you've seen my previous episodes. Okay. Now the I'm gonna leave this as is. There should be 10 millimeters of space. So if you look here, uh, there should be some a plus and a minus. Um, I'm just going to try it out as is. Okay, I'm going to try it out as is. All right, so this is my old seat. Just put it right there for now. Let's try out this seat here. And I had it at a certain height that I liked it, but it's just uh, I'm just gonna have to just gonna have to guess at the height. Kind of liked it up high. Where's the maximum? Where's that line for the max? There's the line for the max here. There's the line for the max right here. I'm not gonna put it all the way up that high. That's just a little too high for me. I think I liked it right about... Oh, let's just go with it. I'm hoping with this seat that I can be uh, up higher. Let me see here. Okay. Now I got no power on. So... Uh, uh, I got no power on. Oh, I gotta... I gotta get the seats. Got to get the pedal. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, all right. Is it too high? Let me see here. Yeah, it's too high. <laughs> it's too high. There's a four inch, uh, of, there's four inches that you have to give up, so this is the four inch right here. Let's see, it's too high. Okay, I used to have it up to the level of the basket, but uh, the basket's not there anymore okay this is this is right and I could feel some travel on this already let's give it a try I'm on gear five oh did I forget the oh I forgot to put my kickstand up there we go Oh wow, this feels really good. Okay, I'm gonna I'm not gonna mess with it because I can feel it. I can feel it bouncing as I I'm putting pressure on it. It's not bottoming, it's not topping. Okay, alright. Oh yeah, wow. I, it almost feels and I must be out of shape it's been a long time since I ran the bike okay I could uh okay it works it works really good I'm actually 
oops, sorry. I'm actually pretty happy with it. Okay, I'm actually pretty happy with it. Um, it seems, the way it comes out of the box, I'm just gonna leave it that way for now. Um, it takes a while to get used to. Um, I'm gonna have to find out my proper height adjustment. I may go out riding today or not. Depends. I know I said I'm washing my my body armor. Actually, it's in the laundry basket. There's a, so it's, it hasn't been washed. Maybe I could take it out of the laundry basket, put it on, and then actually do a ride in it with a suspension post on the red on the red mini at least. Um, now the reason why I got a third seat with the suspension post is because um, I could take it out from here, put it on that, remove that seat post, uh, put this seat post on that one. I mean, what I, what I wanted was, I, I wanted an extra seat post anyway as a backup and just be able to pop, just remove, remove this, put it on that, remove that, put it on this. So anyways, I got an extra seat post and extra seat just to have. Um, all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut out from here. This particular installation, <laughs> this particular installation on the suspension post was, was easy, uh, easy enough. Um, so if you, just, if you just look at the pictures here, this bracket right here, uh, this part of the bracket right here is where the back of the seat, back of the seat will go. So that's that's where you gotta keep in mind. Um, anyways, uh, I do feel like there's suspension on the seat and so uh, it seems like I can ride it in rough terrain without having to stand up or feel like I'm being uh, hit on my butt on, on the, you know, is the the hard tail effect of, of the of the bike seems to be mitigated with the suspension seat post now I haven't tried the thud buster uh, I just got this off the rad power bikes again you can get this in Amazon I think you can get the, this particular model on Amazon for eighty nine dollars versus a hundred and eight dollars off of the uh, the uh, rad power bikes website but I ordered from rad power bikes because I was ordering a whole bunch of stuff and uh, they, I don't know if they do this for everyone, but they included free shipping because I just bought a whole bunch of stuff from them. I bought two bikes, and so um, they just included free shipping. Most of this it was available for sh free shipping anyway, uh, except for the battery, this, the seat, uh, the charging, the charger. That wasn't eligible for free shipping. The only thing that was available was the large basket, the large basket and the... Um, and the uh, rear rack and so um, but they gave me free shipping anyway so uh, it is what it is anyways uh, I like this I'm gonna try to ride around my initial impressions on the on the suspension seat post is that if you have no suspension you have a hard tail for the most part um, and you don't like the bumpiness of it get a suspension seat post that may help um, you can also get a different um, saddle as well you can get a different saddle but I I think this is good enough for me and it's not that big um, it, it, it works for me so uh, but the suspension seat post I, I could tell right away I, I felt the difference right away so I'm look forward to writing it so anyways this concludes this episode feel free to like dislike uh, leave a comment or even do a video response